Hello, this is, um, this is just a little brief demonstration into showing you some of the more uh, advanced options on the IntelliShape handles be, be below this line here. Uh, you'd be surprised a lot of users, even seasoned users, never ventured down into this area. Uh, it's a very powerful area more to gain more productivity in your design. Uh, in this instance, what I want to basically show is that um, in this case, we have a dimension of 1.598, which I would like to be a quarter inch. Uh, in other words, I would want from this point of this part, from this surface, to be a quarter of an inch. But I don't want to distort the alignment of this beam. I basically just want to drag it straight down so I can get that at a quarter inch. Now, you know, you could use mate and align tools, but you could see it would be fairly involved to get that. Uh, if you can go into now the features, into the handles of the IntelliShape, you'll see how easy this can be achieved. Basically, what I want to really do is, first of all, set the handle orientation to be parallel to this edge, because that's ultimately the dimension I want. It's a quarter inch from that surface to that point, but along that edge. Notice how the handle orientates to align with that. Now the next thing I want to do is move that handle to this point. And how do we do that? Is you go edit, uh, set the handle snap point to a point and pick there. It doesn't physically move, but if you go over it, you'll get that white indicator indicating that in essence, that handle really is at that white point there. All right, so if you can envision this handle actually being right there, that's that's what that's indicating. Uh, now, all I want to do is set that distance of a quarter inch, and we can just really come in here and say edit distance from a point. So what I'm saying, I want from this handle, from this point, now remember this handle is really up here, to be a quarter of an inch. Voila, we're done. We got our quarter of an inch there, and we got the natural uh, gap that is associated with it, and we maintain the alignment. Um, once again, you'd be surprised how many people never ventured down here. Uh, start playing around with it. You'll you'll find uh, it's a very useful tool, especially when you get into more structural framework. Uh, it comes very handy when you're dealing with crazy miter corners and of the sort. All right. I hope this helps you and enjoy.